A Chandler SWAT team busting down the front door. Guns drawn, flashlights shining at me. They saw me and they asked me to put my hands up. It was past midnight on a Tuesday late last month. Chandler police cleared the way for Department of Child Safety social workers to remove the three children of Brooks Bryce and Sarah Beck. They busted down the door with a SWAT team for a fever. State Representative Kelly Townsend sat in on a recent court hearing for the parents where they tried to get their children back. The judge upheld the removal and ordered psychological testing on the parents. I think these children should go home immediately. I don't think that the parents should have to prove their worthiness. The night the children were seized, a doctor at this Tempe clinic had alerted DCS to the two-year-old son's potentially life-threatening fever. There was concern the boy wasn't immunized, but the parents never took him to the ER. The child was getting better. The parents knew better. They didn't want to subject their child to an unnecessary spinal tap. Then Chandler PD showed up. We have a court order, temporary custody notice from DCS that's signed by a judge. It might be legal to do that, but is it appropriate? And that level of force warranted for a, a disagreement with a doctor on a child who has a fever. Townsend has worked on legislation making it tougher for authorities to remove children, but critics say she and others in the legislature haven't done enough. Townsend agrees. We need to do more. We need to hold this agency accountable. We've learned the three children are now with grandparents. The mother is nine months pregnant with a fourth child, and Kelly Townsend's concerned DCS might remove the newborn. The Department of Child Safety declined to provide any information on the parents or the children, citing confidentiality laws.